Possibly this is the end of the game. I don't think it'll end because the Dominators uh, being oh, dead the pirates, because the pirates. Yeah. I I fixed my sentence. Don't you uh -huh. like need to? Don't you don't need to insert yourself? <laughs> I insert myself just like players. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess I can't be bad. <laughs> Uh, if this was like Space Rangers 2, this is Reboot, this would be the end of the game coming up, taking care of the final Dominator. Uh, but, uh, I think we'll have to resolve the pirates, because we haven't done what the rangers and scientists wanted us to do for the beginning, which was go into the pirate system and dismantle it from within. Terran is lurking around, they want to do things. And he's glowing with power. He is, in fact, glowing with power, and of course he is sending all this shit at me. But thankfully, I have a large radar range. So, let's go ahead and save the Zizdrum and speak to Terran again. What's up, buddy? Also, program development model for converting energy into matter is a special interest for Terranoids. Hi. I am the supervisor. I oversee the main mission. Stay where you are, Grimmer. Get ready to be transformed. Darren, I have some very valuable information for you. Right. But you don't int accept star transformation technology? I am interested in everything that can be transformed. Data required. Sending Energon... Ener... <laughs> it's greatest technology yet for transforming energy into matter. Data received. Transforming this star has been given top priority. Estimated time, 112 GS. Stay where you are and wait for the transformation to be completed. You're kidding me. Our species' average lifespan is 9.2 GS. A biological organism cannot live for 1,000 years. Transformation time may be shortened if all available resources are used. I have already called my spaceships for that. My goal is to transform all matter into my own type. Wait for your transformation as long as it takes. <laughs> Over and out. Alright. Get on with your transformation. I kind of got like a life to lead. It's neat. So I'm just going to go now. He recalled his ships, huh? Yep. Totally recalled them. Transform this. Centaurin on a star conversion mission. That's Let's right. Stay in here long enough to see this transpire. I think he'll just, like, start orbiting around it. Now, unfortunately, we will not get, uh, the thing to liberate Gralgar. We kind of have to, like, kill Terran and then fucking kill all the people inside here after we kill Terran. But, <sighs> I'm not an achievement hunter. Thankfully. He's just an achievement hobbyist. Yes, yes. <laughs> it's just kind of like a side thing <laughs> that I do on occasion. Well, let's go ahead and see it, and for that... Go ahead and unequip this. And I don't think we need the black goo anymore. For now, we do. I don't think we need insert. I guess we don't need the polarizer. Let's see him just fucking hover around a planet. Hover planet. You'll get caught up on the hover planet. You said you were gonna recall your forces! You are a terrible liar! Is he? Is he He's taking... dying! Well, this will only take forever. Either that or, like, he's slowly building it. He has the tech. Oh my god, he's in the sun! Holy shit! What happened? If we didn't stay around, we would have never seen this! And then, up, oh, let's go into the sun, guys. And so they go into the sun. <laughs> Mom's in the sun now. We're going into the sun, too. Which means I should have shot it and killed one of these motherfuckers so I could count as having liberated this. Now come back! Achievement! <laughs> My achievement! Oh, never mind, they counted. <laughs> Peacemaker! Or maybe not. Liberate Grelgar system. Yay! Achievement! Da -da -da -da. That has become Terran now. Yup. That's a thing they're doing. 
Well, if there's a Space Rangers HD3, that could come back to bite you in the ass. Yeah, we'll be fine. Let's go land <laughs> and collect our reward. And you will be fine. The sun is a fucking spinning... Oh, it blazing does... robot. It uh, does not count as me having... Yeah, whatever. I don't count as having helped to liberate this planet, because and you'll find this funny. As I was landing, a whole bunch of Dominators arrived, because all of the Terrans are coming here to merge into the sun. It's a great effect. They're all jumping wow, in from move. all over. I like the music during this portion too. Gives a air of finality to this. It does, and I am wanted at the nearest Ranger Center, which is of course forever and a day away. Well guys, I'm gone. You uh have fun with your Dysons, whatever. Bye. <laughs> Parting shots. <laughs> Cliggs! <laughs> the Cliggs return to the All Mother. The reproducer of the Terra. That is a lot of Terran ships. Yes. The Gralgar system has passed from the Fern Group of the Pirates to that of the Dominators. <laughs> yep, I left, so suddenly it became Dominator again. And probably by the time that they all absorb into the sun, it'll, be it'll go back to coalition. Yeah. Uh, that's fine with me. Hmm. So I'm wanted at a ranger center immediately so that we can talk about this. Let's see whether this ends the game. Because uh, we haven't resolved this pirate thread. And I am not okay with uh, ending it. Well, maybe I am. I suppose it depends on how big this pirate is going to be. Like, how long is this going to take? Yeah, we were told about the mother of all text quests. Although, we were told that was part of the con mission. Which it was You wasn't. know, maybe, maybe it, it wasn't. Maybe it, it was just like freight I thought. Because I thought con was the end. We had this conversation last week how I thought con was the end. Or perhaps we just didn't roll that mission. Perhaps there's a variety of missions you could roll. You know, there were a lot of mission things popping up. So that's true. Let's see. At least there's new bases being built. The world hasn't stopped. Congratulations, Grimoth. Dominator Terran has been overthrown. You managed to bypass this planet-sized robot's logic circuits and its brain unit that alone spanned a few hundred cubic miles. Thanks to your courage, Grimoth, and the correct use of the Energotron technology, space is safe once again. The victory came dear and cost us the heat of the Gralgar Star, which has been completely exhausted. According to available calculations, the robot will be able to withstand stellar heat for up to 1 to 2 Gs. After that, all the Dominator's active components will melt in the sizzling inferno of 1 billion terajoules. Following their priority orders, Terran troops have practically stopped reproducing and also switched to processing the star. The Coalition has mobilized the Free Rangers to restore law and order in the systems that have been taken over by the Terranoids. March 19th, 3322 shall be remembered in history as the day of victory over the power of Terran. And we got an Order of Dignity. Another one. Okay. So thanks for believing in me. I'm ready to assume my new duties immediately. I am glad the war is over, but please understand that I have other things to take care of in this life. I'm retiring. What do I need to do if I decide to continue the fight against the pirates? So it looks as if by defeating the Dominators, we have a legit option to retire and end the game. There you go. What do I need to do if I decide to continue to fight against the pirates? We need an agent who can infiltrate the pirates and win their trust. If you're still not aware of their special application, if you've com killed all the Dominators without speaking to them once, fly to any pirate base and you'll figure it out on your own. Then you just have to move up in their ranks, and basically you'll have to pick on the Coalition the entire way through, because you've kind of eliminated the Dominators by this point. But it'll be faster than the way we did, really. But be careful. Several of your predecessors are now flying through space as individual atoms, having been discovered by the pirates. Keep in mind that without reliable information about the pirates' plans and their leader's location, Brute force won't help us. We can reconquer as many systems as we want. They'll keep coming back again and again. Only information can bring it into this war. Now I could say, no thanks. A dangerous undertaking like that isn't for me. I deserve a vacation after defeating the Dominators. I have other things to take care of this life. Or, I'm ready to resolve this. You don't have to rush. 
Today we celebrate the Great Victory. We invite you to a special concert dedicated to the victory of the Coalition over the Dominators, and do not worry, there won't be any vain pomposity on display or cockamimi of wards or insincere speeches. Indeed, Ranger modesty is widely known, which is why this concert will be very special, beautiful and stylish, worthy of true heroes. <laughs> well, now I am really curious. Great, I'll come to this concert. Oh my goodness. Is this playing dead, or is this some kind of cinematic effect? Can they survive it? I thought it was just like a giant like space float first. And then all of a sudden the planet is moving. <laughs> I think it's just like a space backdrop, though. So, yeah, just instruments. Concert, guys. No galleons in that one. And, uh, because I did not take the opportunity to retire, let me go ahead and turn down the sound of the game. Ranger Grimoth. The opportunity to become a Baron. Let's see what this all involves. Basically down to the fragments of Kaller that are still in existence. Let's uh, see whether, uh, is Underground still around? I don't think so. No, oh, it is! Let's go back to the Underground. <laughs> I, re I was remembering, uh, whenever you were playing Yakuza 4, uh, this past Saturday, Lethal, uh, mm -hmm. like that hobo was telling you about, like, Underground, and I remember quipping in the chat, Yeah, that's where the pirate face is, you should go there. <laughs> Fucking underground. He's all like about this, like the secret underground and stuff. Glad I know about the stuff. Oh, I, why? Why do you keep telling me about the stuff on Planet Mabel? I don't care. <laughs> Cause maybe it's Maybelline. They want you to make sure it is, or isn't. If they pop it up again. I'll know it's significant <laughs> for sure. You tell them. Greetings, Grimoth. We've been keeping tabs on all your successes and failures for a long time. And we've concluded that you're worthy of the highest level of trust because you spited everyone and said, I'll fucking kill the Dominators myself. Fuck your Dominion. Fuck your DLC. Today you will be shown a special honor. The money you've brought here will net you a map of a special sector. I, I like, looked down at my mic. Good thing I didn't bring a whole lot. <laughs> that is where the next session of the Pirate Commission will be held. It is there that we will decide whether you have merited to become a new pirate baron. I don't know what to say. Just take the map and fly to our secret base. And don't forget to fuel up before you go. Good luck. Well, they didn't take all of our money. It looks like they took 10 Gs. 
Yeah, that's yeah. I, that was I thought they were just gonna take everything I had on the hand. Like, well, the, the balance on this game is a little weird, but it's all right. We'll let it slide this time. A special sector, huh? I'm leaning closer, and I don't see anything special. I'm leaning closer too, and I don't see anything special. Is there something in our inventory that says go place? No, I don't see any messages. No, nothing in our inventory. If needed, of course, there aren't very many Dominators left. By the way, I heard that the pirate Capo Itsosulai kept himself a robot as a pet. Huh. Yeah. yeah. We're like that, too. Well, let's just leave and see what happens. Maybe it'll. Maybe we'll be teleported to the land of milk and honey. Hmm. Well, what wasn't on here before? Arrived to the secret Rogaria pirate base in the Tortuga system. Right, he mentioned that. Where is the Tortuga system? Up there. Which I guess hadn't existed until this point. Well, let's go. You know, we're not exactly in a rush. Although my life insurance will expire <laughs> this year. <laughs> let's, uh, join the cell. I didn't think that I would make this much progress, but... I, whenever I was able to apply all of the tonnage that I could carry with the ship to researching the Dominator threat, I able to polish them off right quick. Keller got his comeuppance. Well, like, resolved one of his endings, of course. We were kind of fucking around with the pirates, and so I don't think we could really get the permission on behalf of the Coalition, or maybe we could. I didn't feel like testing it out because of how fucking long it took me to destroy him again. <laughs> Indeed. Got to see the Terranoid uh, real-time strategy mission, which isn't that complicated. Just involves some uh, unit management. Uh, and we also got to have him waste all of his time with dealing with the star, which is better because it sends everyone to... Oh, wow, this looks cool. Wow. Corsair Death, Setcon... Yanti, Kinlia Ga, right. So we also got to see him waste all. Oh wow! Mm -hmm. It's covered with knobs, Grimmett. Dude, Dude it's like that's the that's the super cool. Wow, what the? What does it, it mean? Has them Disney spears on it, Grimmett. Hide out. This is Pirate Disney World. Uh, right. So and then Blazer. Uh, you can take him out with direct combat. I didn't think that was really feasible for me with what I had. And I just leave that for some of you other kids to explore. That is it. I like how it doesn't have stats. We cannot destroy this thing. Hide out for the pirate clan leaders despite of its huge, huge size. Evidently requires major repair and doesn't pose a threat to anyone. Totally believe it. Um, so yes, we uh, managed to... Uh, you could either self-destruct Blazer or you can keep him stashed on a planet for scientists to inevitably meddle with. Executioner. DMB. These, uh... Defenders certainly have some serious business ships. There's also a lot of asteroids around here. Prusag and Lumin Luminior. Yeah. Cool name. yeah, there's an achievement for fucking, like, visiting unexplored planets, too. I don't give a shit about that. Okay. Well, let me go ahead and plan a save down. And I guess I'll do this on episode seven. Well, we'll go ahead and make this a special. Special case. Uh, let's see what happens. I'm, I'm really curious. As I slowly go into landing. Welcome to our pirate sanctuary of cosmic space, Grimoth. We hope you ain't bringing pigs on your tail. <laughs> Those douches don't even realize that somebody can live here in clover. As for the nosier specimen, we've learned to deal with them in a swift and neat manner, and everybody's nose is kept clean. Now, I know about your merits before our brotherhood, 
but don't get lost in the clouds just yet. This gathering includes only the most respected and powerful persons in our organization, looking out for their security and peace of mind. High Baron Chushkachter even ordered to activate the Subportal Blockerator. The upcoming discussion will determine your future fate and career prospects. But while you're waiting for everybody to convene, I recommend you drop by our shop. Trust me, there's plenty to check out in there. If you've got the dough, you can get yourself some shiny new toys. Ah -ha! Chill, Griffith, and don't worry about anything. Ah -ha -ha! Times two. <laughs> so what kind of stuff do you have here to buy, out of curiosity, since you're saying that I should check this stuff out? I mean, a Pigamore Indian? <laughs> Holy shit! It's like they knew, even though it's certainly so mechanically inferior to my engine that I wouldn't replace it. It's like they knew. Pegamore... How did they know? Because <laughs> <laughs> I didn't... Oh, Upgraded radar. Code. That looks pretty cool. Upgraded scanner. A Pegamore droid, which is so weak compared to what I got. Myoplasma gripper. Upgraded gripper to Hocus. That's a pretty strong gripper. Upgraded shield generator. Myoplasmic shield generator. That is mechanic. That's slightly worse than the shield generator. The problem is it reduces engine speed. And that's a no-no for me. Frag cannon. Wave phaser. Atomic vision universe. Tur Turbo gravitron. Now these these are the weapons. We Turbo have. Gravitron. Esso Daffer fires a cluster of nanomachines, dealing 39 damage and weakening the armor of a target. For safety reasons, software limitations have been placed on the operating period and efficiency of activated nanites. And then, Capacitor destroys armor with high voltage discharges, dealing 1 to 44 damage within that radius. When concentrating fire at a specific target, the power is increased with time via surface ionization of the target's hull. Well, it's nothing I'm really interested in. Battle alarm! Battle alarm! Battle alarm! Seven hells, Ranger Girth! What the Rastabon are you still doing here? We're under attack by the Coalition! Climb inside your clunker and fight! Go! Faster! Faster! Hang her! Toss him into the orbit! I'll kill them all, till there's nobody left but me. On my way. I thought you had some kind of portal blocker here. What happened with that? Everybody freeze. Stay where you are. This is Special Fleet Commander Admiral Dirtius. All exits from the system have been blocked. You are surrounded. Surrender while you still can. Warning. We were attacked by the Coalition's forces. Somebody ratted us out. I'm ordering everybody to attack the enemy and break the blockade. Come on, boys. Let's pulverize these knuckleheads. I'm guessing what they did is they tracked your position to their... Secret base! Hell if I know, all I know is that we've apparently got some invaders. I only see one guy right now, though, so let's see what happens. Invader? Well, this one also, be... well, go ahead. I was gonna say, this map is nice and small. Your radar covers pretty much all of it. I don't know whether it's the size of the map or just. I think it's the I think my radar is just that good when I'm actually on the map. Oh yeah, the shit comes. Well, this is, these are, you know what, whatever. <laughs> I'm not, they might have lots of DACA. I'm not gonna fucking crit <laughs> A military Hello, base! I'm a crossbow. <laughs> yes, you are. Yes, I'm putting this away. Let's do this shit. I'm, I'm fucking, I'm excited. Like, I haven't been this excited playing this game. Like, this is... this is like... I need to stop babbling. Let's get on with it. Come here, you motherfucking military base. As it charges... Is it just gonna fucking grab it? Looks like it. Holy shit. Whoa! Where'd you go? It became one with it! Whoa. That's... Yeah, I guess I didn't need to focus on the military base at all. 
pirate. I'm having to pay attention to like who's my enemy and who's not my enemy. I know all these ships. And it's not easy to point out like the Dominator stuff was. Well, I I guess we Wow, that was that was a pretty ineffective attack. I don't really feel as if I contributed a whole lot though. <laughs> Well, as long as they think you were attacking that, you know, military base that just Warning, the jarheads are boarding. Quick, somebody come to the pirate base to sweep away the newly arrived trash. Oh, yeah. That's... I guess that was their version of boarding. <laughs> That's all I was thinking. It just fucking slammed into the side of it, and then we have Palangs and Malachs just like... Up, 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 right onto the ship. Yeah, that's what I get for not immediately responding as I was shooting at I was, like, right there to respond. Oh, everyone's gonna land, it looks like. Do we go to, like, text-based stuff now? Probably. Yes. With great skill, you guided your ship through the fighting, military, and pirate ships, and brought it into the closest open hangar at the pirate station. Before landing, you managed to see the military base that so brazenly docked at the pirate habitation. Yeah, docked. You found its menacing appearance foreboding, but what are you going to do? Somebody's gotta save everyone once again. Extracting yourself from the ship, you were instantly immersed in the surrounding chaos. Everybody around was running, screaming, and waving their weapons. It looked like the pirates were preparing to give battle to the army boys. But not everything was what it seemed. You should have turned your back, because some rogue pulling tried to hijack your ship. You sh I should have turned my- whatever. You dragged him by his neck from the cabin, and his punishment ordered him to explain how to get to the place where the soldiers are gathering through the attack. Where are the gates on the left? Squeaked the pirate, and spryly jerked out of your grasp. Rather than chase him down, you started off to where he had directed. Let's actually try to lock up the ship and protect it better this time. Getting where you needed to go proved to be easy. It was enough to move in the opposite direction of the pirates who were bolting away from the danger. But... I don't think we'll be entering the hangar. This video. It, it, it'd be easier to do, like, the suspense thing if, like... This is, like, live. Instead, I'm just gonna have to, like, really, like, drag I this know. on. Like, just be, like, an <laughs> Before asshole. Before we get on with it, though, I need to make sure that I have an empty tank, if you know what I mean. That's on the recording. <laughs> well, either way, I need an empty tank. We'll see you next time, folks.